Praise God, my brothers and sisters. Good morning. I trust you're well and God is keeping you wherever you are. It's a beautiful day God has given unto us. We rejoice and be glad in it. We are in the month of March and bring about double for our sorrow and double for our shame. And they, my dear friend, I'm talking about you are blessed. You are blessed. Listen to the language. You know, you shall be blessed. You are blessed. Because we need to be a manifestation of the blessing of God. Ephesians chapter 1 verse 3 says this. Blessed be the God of, the, of our Father, of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us with all spiritual blessing in the heavenly places in Christ. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us with all spiritual blessings in heavenly places in Christ. This is that the blessing of God is present continuous. The tense is present continuous. We are an embodiment of this. But my dear friends, we are not calling on, 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 on new things. We are calling on that which is ours. That which the Father has given. And you're calling about double portion. By the death of Christ on the cross, your life as a believer should not be the way it was. Your life as a believer should be double, should be better off, should be in fact far much better off. I love this text so much. It's one of my favorite texts. That who has blessed me with all spiritual blessings in heavenly places in Christ. Remember, we know this from, from, uh, from even the, the fellowship. Those of you who come, we've known this. That by faith, we call that it is unseen to become seen. And if in the unseen realm of the Spirit, the Father has blessed me with all things in the heavenly places in Christ, that Jesus remains to be the door. Jesus remains to be the key. But my dear friends, because of this love, because of the all that means all, then we are guaranteed a double blessing, a double portion, a double increase, double for your shame, double for your soul. Let us pray. Almighty Father, I thank you and I bless you for your children, Lord. I pray, Father, in the name of Jesus, may your mighty hand bless them, Lord. You who has released all blessings, Lord, that are required in our lives, I pray, Father, for a manifestation of these blessings. I pray for a release of these blessings. I pray for an outpouring of these blessings. I pray for a touch of this blessing. I pray that, Lord, may they encounter your goodness today in the land of the living. May they have double, Lord, because you've blessed us, Lord, with double for the glory of your name through our Lord Jesus Christ. I thank you for that and I bless you. Just no praise and thanksgiving. Amen. My wonderful friends, you stay blessed. See you again next time.